Hi guys, I went ahead and wanted to put up another video. I gotta keep it consistent. I went ahead and went with this glowy, simple summer bronze look. I went ahead and just did a basic face, not too, and not basically a tutorial for beginners who wanna look glam for the summer, but not too glam. You don't wanna look like you tried too hard. So here we go. I hope you guys like it and leave me some requests for what you guys want to see and I would love to do that. I really want to try to do like a smoky eye with a glitter cut crease. Let me know what you guys think. Alrighty guys, thank you so much. Okay guys, we're going to start off with our SPF. Apply smaller things. Don't want any sun damage. I'm gonna go into my CeraVe moisturizer. Put a little over here as well. And then I'm gonna go ahead and go in slow an eye cream that I can't find. Un momento. Okay, so we're gonna go and I'm gonna take this Pure Elise eye cream. Put that under my eye. We're gonna do today's video a little different because today I'm gonna be sampling the new Hourglass Stick Foundation. Alrighty, we're gonna go into the Hourglass new Stick Foundation. I am in the shade Golden Amber. So we're gonna test this out. I'm not gonna use a primer or usually use my orange corrector. I wanna see how good this covers. It's said to be really full coverage, so let's see. Mm. Let's see guys, my first time trying it out with y'all, it's $46, can be found online at Sephora, in store, I got mine in store, because the lord knows I can't wait. I'm going to go ahead and go in with my Artiste Ovo 7 and start to blend with this brush as well, it's known to use less product and give you better coverage with your foundation or your concealer whatever you want to use it with let's see how it blends out mm, let's see if it covers my hyperpigmentation take it over my eyelids just give a nice even coverage so far, so good. You can still see some of the spots there, so I'll probably go over that. Let's see how well it layers. Just take a little bit more. I want to just focus it. I want a little bit more coverage. Put a little bit on my neck. Let's see. And then. Go in with the Oval 7 brush. Okay, it's building up really nicely. Look at that coverage, you can barely see. It looks really yellow on camera. But in person, there's not that much of a difference between my neck and my face. Let's see. I think I really like it guys let's see let's see how we like it throughout the video now let's go in with our concealer today we're gonna be using the Bare Minerals Bell Skin and I'm in the shade medium golden I don't know why I'm talking like that guys just decided to give myself a quick little accent do the use Beep, beep. Does anyone else like making sound effects? Cause I do. I feel like it makes it more fun. I'm gonna go ahead and spray my beauty blender cause I was too lazy to wet it. 
using my Mario de Badescu facial rose water and start to blend that in. Another tip that I learned from Jaclyn Hill, and I've always done, is she said to never just pat your concealer going one way because then it's gonna sit to go that way. Okay, so blend, blend, blend. And again, confuse the concealer, go multiple ways, back and forth, back and forth. Like Aaliyah said, back, back, forth, and forth. I like to take it on my eyelid to prime. I do what I know. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and take my Airspun Translucent Powder and just set everywhere that I just highlighted. I guess you can kind of call this a bake because I leave the powder on until after I start the rest of my face. I like to leave that powder on. I'm just gonna go ahead and just really be messy and not care where I'm applying it, just setting everywhere and I think put my eyebrow with a cream because at the end of the day, I'm wiping it all off. Don't I look so cute? We're done with the video. Have a great day. Just kidding. <laughs> That'd be horrible. Don't ever go out your house like this. People are gonna think you're crazy, boo. They're gonna think you are crazy. Okay. To set the rest of my face, I'm gonna take my MAC Mineralize and Zoak and shoot it. Please excuse my husband. He's watching America's Got Talent and he's yelling and being absolutely crazy and disrespectful. Put some respect on it, tell him. Put some respect on it for your wife. I'm go ahead and just, with the same brush, because the airspun powder is so light, I always like to make sure I go in with whatever brush I dust off my face powder with just so that way I don't have a white cast. Okay, now we're gonna go into some bronzer. Some bronzer with my bronzer brush from Morphe, the M527, and my Glam Bronze from L'Oreal. Dust it. Go on the perimeter of my face. Make it a little bit smaller. You know, because us forehead challenged people. Blessed with too much of a forehead, but that's okay. You gotta learn to love yourself, boo. always said if I had a smaller forehead and green eyes pfft, you wouldn't be able to mess with me but God did that on purpose he said nope your ego would be so big so you gotta learn to live with what you got okay right now I look like I have a bronzer helmet on that's what blending's for I am gonna take this Morphe brush it's just a large powder brush it doesn't have a number I'm gonna start to blend everything together because I don't want to look cray cray. Never that. Tell them I'm never crazy. Okay. 
Let's see, do we want to do blush? Yes, I'm going to take this Clinique Cheek Pop and Zero T Peach Pop. And I'm going to take my Sigma Duo Fiber F50 and just apply my blush with that. This is going to give it a very light wash. And I don't want that much color. I want it to be more on the bronzy side anyways. As you can see, it's just giving it a nice little flush of peach. Nothing crazy. Don't get crazy. Okay, let's see. And then I'm gonna take my Anastasia Glow Kit and that's glow. And glow it up, boo. Let's see. Okay, we're gonna be taking, I think I wanna take golden bronze and dripping in gold. I'm gonna just go a little ham. Ooh, ooh. They're not ready. They are not ready for the highlights. Yeah, highlights. Guys. Is anybody else excited about Nikki Tutorial's palettes? I can always see it on August 15th. Oof, oof, oof. You guys, I can never have too much highlight. I would always like to look like a glowing goddess. Look at that nose. Oof, look at that nose. Oof, look at that cheek. Oof, 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 oof. Okay, I like to put a little on my shin and my upper lip. And then I am gonna go in with golden bronze and put that on my eye just to give it a little bit more depth and glow. Literally putting it everywhere, putting it in the crease. You know what I think I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and go in with my bronzer and put that in the crease because it has a little shimmer and I just think it'll look pretty and give it a little bit more depth. So let's do it. Just taking this Anastasia brush, a dual ended brush. It came it comes in all of her eyeshadow palettes. Okay, let's see. I'm gonna take a little bit of my bronzer and just define that crease with the same brush. Windshield wiper motions. Can you guys see the difference? You can see a slight difference. It looks a little more defined. That's good. And Let's do our eyebrows really quickly and take my MAC 208 and my Anastasia Loose Brow Wiz Powder and this is in the color medium brown. I need to find the lid but I can't find it. I usually just pour a little out and pour some on my vanity and just do my brows real quick. And take my spoolie, which I also cannot find, story of my life. Found it, okay. Spoolie, it's a max spoolie. You don't have to be fancy though, you don't need a max spoolie. You can use any regular spoolie. And then I'm just gonna go ahead and do my brows. Guys, that's really dark right there, you see that? I messed up, it's okay. I'll show you how you can save yourself. That's why you always gotta have a spoolie. I'm gonna brush the product up. There, boom, see how I saved that? Okay. Okay, let's see. That brow's done, just wanted to do quick. Not too much to it. 
Cause ain't nobody got time for that. And I have a mirror down here, but like you're looking down. Let's see. I always like to extend the tail of my brow because I don't feel like I really have one. And honestly, I feel like the lady that did my eyebrows last time messed them up. It was so sad. I got them waxed. I usually get them threaded, which I should have just did, but I didn't. And I didn't listen to my guy. I just went and got them waxed because I was right there. Listen to your gut, ladies. Listen to your gut. Okay, let's see. Let's fill in the rest. Really? With Zen? With the brows. I feel like I want to define this one a little bit more. I feel like it doesn't look as even as I like. Right there. I want to look a little bit more even. Okay, now we're gonna go in with mascara. I'm not gonna be doing falsies. Okay, we're gonna go in with mascara. I'm going in with my Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. This is one of my favorites. I really wanna get the waterproof one. Has anybody tried it? I'm kind of scared because what if it sucks and I don't like it and I just waste my money? So I don't know. I kind of feel like if I find something that works for me, I'm gonna stick with it, you guys know. What I like to do with this mascara is I put on one coat, I let it dry. I'll go in and put on another coat and another coat. <gasps> Just stab myself in the eye. Okay. I like this look because it's simple and glam and glowy. And let's face it, not everybody knows how to put on falsies. Not everybody has time to put on falsies. I know when I'm running late, mm -mm. I'm like, nope. I'm about to put on some mascara, some concealer, and that's it. Okay, let's see. Bottom lash time. I need a mirror, guys. I'm gonna poke my shelf in the eye. And I don't have a mirror. Okay, whatever. We're just gonna go with it. Sometimes I feel like my lower lashes look better than my top lashes. I'm like, how does that even work? How does that happen? Okay, let's see. Go back. That's as good as we're getting for lashes. Pretty good. Pretty, pretty good. Okay. Now we're just gonna do some gloss and finish up the video. I'm gonna go in with my NARS Orgasm. Yes. Yes, gloss. Okay. What's up? Okay, loud car. <gasps> okay, now we're just gonna go in with our tried and true fix plus. Yes. Spray my face, wrench it, mmm, fix plus, yes. Let it dry. I feel like I need a fan like Rosita, a fancy fan, a fancy fan. Let my face dry. Okay guys, that is my simple glowy 
this look bye yes okay guys thank you so much for watching positive vibes and have a good week bye guys see you next time